Hello all of you here's a quick guide on how to register for the ASET examination for the upcoming term so just open your uh, google chrome or any other browser you just need to type iei ASET just open the first link over here go down go for the exam details examination dates over here um, so the exam is happening on 13th of october uh, the last day to register is 5th of october click on register over here the moment you click it will ask you to enter your full name your email id make sure the email id which you are putting in over here is something which is your own you are using it and your own mobile number create a password and once you enter your email id it will ask you to verify it so click on get otp you will get an otp on your email id put it over here and there will be an option for verify click on verify and it will be verified similarly you have to do it for your mobile number once everything is verified you need to click on sign up the moment you click on sign up it will lead to another web page wherein again it will be asking you to put the email id and password just put it and click on sign up again when you click on sign up this particular page will open up all right so in this page we will click on registration form so click on registration form these are the details that we have to fill in so make sure you are sitting down with your class 10 class 12 mark sheets um, and your passport size photograph uh, photograph click on apply now over here so these are the details which you have to fill in you have to fill in your personal details salutation first name middle name surname uh, gender birth, date of birth basic for candidate id proof you can upload your uh, aadhar card over here um, id proof number which is the aadhar card number and you can uh, you need to upload your aadhar card over here so make sure you're sitting with the aadhar card if you have a pan card you can also upload your pan card this is not mandatory because it does not have that red star star mark so you can either upload i for the id proof aadhar card or maybe passport i will suggest you can go for aadhar card nationality you will fill in the basic details over here right permanent address it can be same as your uh, address on top here again you need to upload your photo photograph passport size photograph make sure these things are you are keeping in mind these things because generally they reject your uh, membership if you don't upload or they reject your registration if you don't upload a proper photograph it should have a plain white background and your dress can be any dark color so it can be black it can be dark blue and your yours yours should be visible so make sure and your full face should be visible make sure you have all these considerations while uploading your passport size photograph once you have uploaded then you have to click on confirm and next i am not able to move to the next one but i'll quickly guide you as to what they will ask you in the next one so in the next one they will ask you to put in examination detail education details this is class 10 and class 12 first please upload the class 10 details in that you need to put in uh, the year in which you cleared your class 10 examination the overall marks or cgpa that you scored in your class 10 then you click on save again you need to upload your class 12 results so it should be class 12 when you cleared the examination and how much marks did you total how much marks you scored on, on aggregate and then save and next the moment you click on save and next that is it in education detail they will just ask 10 and 12 exam details state and city again whichever city state you are appearing your examination from try to upload it there uh, again very basic details they will ask declaration there will be a few things mentioned you can read it click just click on the declaration and click on the next preview form just make sure you preview the entire thing all the details are correct properly uploaded once it is done you will have to click on ok this entire process will not take more than 10 minutes of time given if you are sitting down with your photograph aadhar card right once this is done you can move to transaction hist uh, the transaction it will take you automatically to the transaction part 500 rupees is the 
registration fees you can make a payment through upi net banking card bank transfer whatever the details are there over over there mentioned so once the payment is done it will take you to transaction history and here it will be showing that the transaction has been made receipt has been done and you will be registered for the asset examination all the details regarding the examination you will receive it on your mail id so make sure you keep checking your mail id and phone number but majorly all the communication happens through your mail id so try to check your mail id uh, regularly at night and in mornings right once this is done you are ready for your examination examination is on 13th of uh, october and the results will be declared on 18th of october if you have any further questions you can let us know in the comment section below thank you so much